Hello you guys, this is your girl Lilium here and welcome to a new video where I am back with a new batch of star skin masks. So in this batch I uh, just went shopping and I got some of the masks that I have not tried. Um, I got the anti-aging lift away mud face sheet mask with green tea clay. Then I got the Hydrating Biocellulose Second Skin Face Mask, uh, Red Carpet Ready it's called. Then I got uh, the most expensive Star Skin VIP face mask, which is the Illuminating Luxury Biocellulose Second Skin Face Mask, the Diamond Mask. But for today we are going to be demoing and reviewing this bad boy, which is the Purifying Lift Away Mud Face Sheet Mask. Silk mud uh, with pink French clay. On the front it says deeply purifying. It is, it unclogs pores, absorbs excess oil, anti-blemish care and skin texture smoothing. Some of the ingredients are purifying kaolin clay, regulating pink French clay, unclogging bentonite clay and brightening licorice roots and a few other things. Now I have a few impurities as you can see right here and here my face is breaking out a little bit and I suspect it's uh, hormonal. Also like around my uh, chin I have a few impurities that I would like to help my skin get rid of so I figuring we would go for this one today and I'm really curious to see how uh, the face mask looks. It has a lot of clay in there so it's very like it says, purifying and it lifts, lifts away excess oil and dirt from your face. On the back it has the usual five steps. The first one is to cleanse your face and pat dry. And then you have to remove the mask from the sachet and unfold both pieces. And then you start with the upper part, remove the first transparent film. And uh, yeah, it basically has a hole. Uh, five steps here on the back that is very easy to follow. Right here on the bottom it actually also says something about the mask which I am going to read to you so you get a better, um, also for myself, so I get a better understanding of how the mask works. Purify your skin to perfection with Star Skin's Lift Away Silk Mud Pink French Clay a revolutionary mess-free mud mask combining the deep cleansing power of mud with the convenience of a sheet mask. Constructed from ultra-fine gauze, each mask is infused with a powerful trio of pink French clay, kaolin clay and bentonite clay to blitz blemishes, blackheads and blocked pores without drying the skin. Skin looks instantly clearer, brighter and more radiant with visibly tightened pores and a matte, shine-free finish. Perfect for oily, blemished or acne-prone skin. Now normally I don't have acne-prone skin at all, actually my skin is... Um, uh, it's mostly like dry I think, especially with the coming autumn and it starts to get colder, my skin automatically tends to get a bit dry on the cheeks right here on the forehead and the chin but uh, just for my few blemishes and around my mouth I noticed that I started to get some impurities uh, I wanted to kickstart um, the cleansing of my skin with this face mask so I'm gonna pull it out of the packaging here then we open it and I'm gonna take it out of the sachet all right, so it looks like this. It looks a bit different than the other masks I've tried. This is like in two parts. So I have one part here, one part here. Place the upper piece on face, matching the position of eyes. Then remove the white film, smooth out or gently stretch the mask to ensure a perfect fit. This is the mask. It is very delicate and very soft. So I'm gonna try and be really careful with this. And this is the bottom part that I have, but I don't really think it matters that much. Um, so I'm gonna try to put 
uh, it has the mask on this side and the plastic on the other side as you can see I'm gently going to kind of catch the mask up here and then gently gently pull away as I smooth it out it is definitely a lot more uh, fragile than the other mask I've tried. They're more like stretchy and stuff. This is like almost like a fine paper mask or something. It's very, very delicate. And now we repeat the same process with the upper face part. Uh, the nose part is kind of really weird and fucked up and now I look creepy as fuck But we're gonna leave this bad boy on for 20 minutes and I will be back with my thoughts Okay guys, I'm back and this is my result my pimple is of course still there, but my face, like, I hope it kickstarted something, but my face is really, really, it's super lifted. I can't explain it. It feels like a facelift. It's, I'm not even kidding. Uh, as the mask dried, uh, it got harder and harder to move my face or even talk. And when I removed it, uh, there was still some excess clay just like um, all over my face. So I just took a clean um, cotton pad, uh, sprayed it with some toner water and removed the last parts and now I'm left with just a face that feels super matte and smooth and lifted and the smell of the face mask was gorgeous too, like a very, uh, very light uh, natural scent and was an absolute joy to uh, have on my face. It didn't slide around or do anything and it was actually a really, uh, really comfortable experience. It is different from the uh, second skin uh, face masks uh, since uh, the material is different but it is very um, was very uh, fragile so I think that's one thing uh, you have to take into consideration when getting it is that you need to be very careful with it and take your time with placing it on your face so don't be in a hurry when you're doing this face mask because it does take a little bit of care uh, I like the fact that it's also a mud mask without all the mess because I do have a, a mask from Lush that is a um, coffee coffee mask kind of thing and also the jelly mask so I have so they are tend to be a lot more messy when you clean them you know not only when you put them on but also when you clean them off and this one had like it didn't wasn't messy at all I didn't when I pack, unpacked it and put it on my face I did get a little bit of residue from it on my hands but it was easy to clean off and afterwards it was very easy to remove the excess uh, product from the face mask from my face. All in all, I would definitely give this face mask a 5 out of 5 um, because it's easy to use, you just have to be a little bit careful. A definitely a noticeably a noticeable effect from the face mask straight away. The smell was good and it's just super easy to use thank you guys for watching the video make sure to click like if you enjoyed the video guys and make sure to subscribe as well if you haven't already i will see you guys in my next video soon take care until i see you again and have a lovely day Mwah. bye bye